It's one of them days, bro, where your boy Azur reacts. I'll post another video, man. Uh, you guys read the title, man. I know you guys are excited. Six BTS fans, he's one secret hater. Odd man out by Jubilee. Now look, it has been a very interesting journey for me. You know what I'm saying? Listening to BTS for the first time till now. You know what I'm saying? Listening to uh, BTS for the first time, bro. Hey, man, I was a, a hater, bro. But you know what I'm saying? As, as months went by, listening to more BTS, you know what I'm saying? Watching the guide that I watched uh, a couple days back, I've slightly changed my mind on them. You know what I'm saying? I start to finally see the appeal on BTS. I, mean, I would consider myself an ex-BTS hater, you know what I'm saying? Which is why I'm a perfect guy for this video. I can really figure out what makes who a hater, you know what I'm saying? As an ex-hater myself. So yeah, we're gonna check this video out. Uh, I'm gonna stop yapping, because I'm talking too much. If you guys are new around here, leave a like, comment, subscribe. Let's get straight into this video, man. Let's get it, bro. Jubilee, talk to me, bro. Good humans, Shut welcome to another up. episode. Shut the fuck up. Shut the... Good humans, bro. Don't piss me off, bro. Just say hi, hello. Welcome to the video, bro. Get, get it. Let me chill out. You know what I'm saying? That's right. For all you K-pop fans out there and the BTS army, yeah. this one is for you. Super grateful to our sponsor, Simple Habit, for bringing this episode to you guys. It's an amazing meditation app. Ian meditates all the time. I do. I'm a busy man. I get frenzied all the time. Yeah. But when I meditate in the morning, it just comes. Right, right, Simple right. Habit is all about mental well-being. Right, enough ground. yapping, bro. Enjoy the episode. Please welcome BTS. BTS. International super boy band in the world. BTS. I literally have a tattoo of my bias on my ankle. You're joking. Me. There's no tattoo, bro. Can that be for V or can that be for something else? Okay, you know what? I'll take it. I'll take it. Oh, V. My bias. Who's my bias? I gotta, I gotta figure that out. There's seven BTS fans. I'm a BTS fan. I am a BTS fan. I am a BTS fan. I am a BTS fan. I'm a BTS fan. I'm a BTS fan. I am a BTS fan. One is a liar. If the group discovers who the liar is, they'll split a cash prize. Mm. Yeah. If the liar survives, he or she wins the entire prize. Alright, so I guess we should just go around and talk about how we got into BTS. The talk first to person to start talking, I was gonna suspect him immediately, right when the buzzer started. Shut the fuck up, bro. Shut the fuck up, bro. Don't be don't be judging people off of, of, of first impression, you know what I'm saying? Let them speak, bro. You know what I'm saying? Take some notes before you come to a conclusion, bro. You know what? Fuck you. You know what? <laughs> You're the hater, bro. I was like, okay, guys. Um, I actually started just because I wanted to see what like the hype of K-pop was. And soon after, I bought tickets to their concert. It started okay. in February, and I've been whipped ever since. So I got into loving BTS in January. And like, I was like digging their fashion. Yo. Ever since, I'm like so obsessed. Yep. BTS don't dress like that, bro. That ain't no drip. Yeah, what a drip head, bro. I was like, I don't think that's a... I'm hating, bro. I'm a hater today. Wow. I gotta apologize, man. I take everything back. Jose speaking facts. Reason you I love Jose banned. already, bro. That's my type of BTS fan. He said he's a that's for a BTS fan, bro. Their fashion. Yeah. So one of my best friends, her dad actually was one of the concert organizers for the Wings tour. And so she was like, hey, I have like extra tickets. And then after that, I was like, oh my gosh, like I have to get into them. And it was just like downhill ever since then. <laughs> so do you guys like all consider yourselves like fan or army? Cause you know, there's like a difference. Okay, I'll, I'm not an army, bro. You know what I mean? I would say I'm army. I respect. I, I, you know what, I'll, I'll, I'll consider myself a fan. Nice, I don't know. Fan is a big word, bro. I'd say I'm borderline. I'm ARMY. ARMY. Because I'm a newer fan, I would say fan. Like, actually, I, I'm not even, like, knowing of this big difference until now. So what do your friends your age think about, like, you being ARMY? I mean, most being ARMY. Damn, I yeah. see the eye crease. Bro's 50 minimum. Shit tragic! <laughs> But I, I respect the dedication for the army, man. I don't care. Yeah. Do you like openly tell them that oh, you're yeah. in the army? Yeah. 
Well, Tay is a little, you know, older than us, like everybody else who was in the box, and that kind of threw me off at first. I think it's cool, but even I was like, you're kind of a grown ass man, you know what I'm saying? Damn! <laughs> hey, Adam, bro, come on, dog. Come on, dog. <laughs> All right, we age is just a number, you know what I'm saying? To uh to a certain extent, you know what I'm saying? Let's relax. <laughs> Got a minute left to try to figure out. Okay, who everyone's that biased. Like, oh, Jay Hope, Jay Hope, Jay Hope, Jungle Sam. Sam. <laughs> I'm double. Yeah, all right, all right, we get it, bro. Bias. <laughs> Tay I'm and Hobie. <laughs> so my ultimate bias is Jungkook. And then yeah. I was bias wrecked by Jimin. And Hell then yeah. Yoongi is coming for me. I feel like you have to bias every single one and then decide. I ain't gonna lie, look, if I had to decide, it's either August STD or Real Madrid RM, bro. Rap Monster, bro. One of those two, I think. Um, Maybe even Jimmy. I fuck with Jungkook. But I think it's like either Sugar or RM. Like who's your bias is? So you don't have a bias? I mean, not really. I would maybe Namjoon only because he's so maybe. smart. Okay. But well, Repeat up, yes sir. Be on depth state, man. Uh, well, we got three seconds, so la <laughs> Huh? What? All right. I, I, I think I just figured something out. Nah, hey. Alan definitely wasn't giving us as much as we wanted. <clears throat> Trinity. Oh, she was like emanating some type of energy next to me. Sayane. Nyanada. Get the fuck out of here. Love you guys. Get the fuck out of here, bro. Bye. Everybody has a little too much info. Easy to slip by as just a casual army. So, like, one yeah, of the I wrinkles, bro. Bro's 50 minimum, bro. My plans were eliminate the baby armies first. If everyone feels confident that you've already caught the mole, you can end the game now. But if the majority has doubt... No, let's continue, man. All right, cool. After that first round, you know what? I do think that guy's army. Alan, he's army, bro. Actually, no, a fan. Alright, she's a fan. This girl yapping about borderline. She's a fan. My guy Jose. Hey, that's my guy. Respects. You know what I'm saying? With the jean shorts and the purple polo. Respects. Uh, 50 year old. I forgot his name. Big respects, bro. Yeah, he's, he's a fan. Um, look, confirm, confirm for me, it's Jose and this girl right here, I forgot her name. The rest, we'll see, bro. The mole, you can end the game now, but if the majority has doubt, the game will continue. So raise your hand if you wish to continue the game. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I was able to get some indication with the last two seconds of the game. Okay. So if I go, Tony Montana. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, I don't know what that is. I... What is bro yapping about, bro? This 50 year old has been doing too much studying, bro. Get him out of here, bro. I know what you mean by exactly. that. Exactly, that's where my delineation of. Alright, now my fear is he might be a baby army. Or again, I exactly. fully admitted to That's my fear. Being, like joining this. us in February. You gotta know Lachi Molala, Tony Montana. These are just inside jokes every army knows. Inside, okay. Tony Montana, I had no idea. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm with you, Mika. Mika. I'll fix that after this. I know most of the YouTube videos, which is why I'm actually confused as to why I don't know that. But, I mean, if I have to whip it out, I will. I literally have a tattoo of my bias on my ankle. Please show us. You're joking. Me. Mm -hmm. Where? And my best friend has one of Jay no. in the same place for Jimin. Can that be for V or can- Bro, that's V for Victor or some shit, bro. It's not V for V, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> can that be for something else? Go be V for Victor, like bro. Her, her man or some shit, bro. Janky, Nike Swish. That could be a whole lot of things. I don't know. And Nike so you Swish, said you bro. were you got into them since February of this year. Yes. What albums have you listened to? I mean, pretty much all of them. I'd say my favorite one is probably Speak Yourself because that's like what got me into them. They're, they don't have an album that's named Speak Yourself. <laughs> love you. My guy, Jose. Talk to him, bro. Talk to him. 
Tell her again, man. All right, never mind. She is, she is on my sus list, bro. My guy, Detective Jose, bro. Him and his goatee, bro. He's got that shit on lock, bro. He's the biggest army there. That's my type of guy, Jose. Hey, that, that's my boy. So you love this new album, this yes. past album. What B-side do you like from that album? Oh my god, B-side? Like, like, that's not, not like the not title, a title track. track. Like, not Boy Not Boy Oh, Boy okay. Um, Home. Home's my favorite. I'm gonna be honest, I, I wasn't a huge fan of the last album. I wasn't. I wasn't either, but I like Boy With Love. I, I thought I, I wasn't, and then I gave it another listen over. I was like, what am I talking about? <laughs> if I said that shit, I would have been flamed. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Everyone was all you and started asking me and I was all like I literally forgot everything like you don't We want to get anybody who has any type of suspect feeling out because I, I trust my gut I just seriously thought that there's no way this dude <laughs> could be She hasn't said BTS much bro She hasn't said she, she just made one heart sign bro And laughing all the time bro And Damn, I need more screen time, bro. I need more. I needed more Brianna screen time, bro. I was falling in love. Sorry. Y'all made me expose my tattoo just to call me fake. <laughs> That's so messed up. Okay, so you said you were borderline. Yeah, I'm borderline. Why? Because I just started in like 2017, and I guess because my like obsessive K-pop phase is. 2017. Behind. What year did this come out? 19. Weird. Cause I started getting into K-pop in like 2010. I feel like when you are in the army, you are proud to represent. I so can you see don't it on the comments. Say, mm, I'm iffy about it. Okay, I was- Jose. Jose. Bro's a, a true BTS detective, bro. If anything, K-pop detective. I was knee deep in the YouTube world and I was so obsessed with uh, BTS. <clears throat> so I decided to apply to the airport because I knew that they fly through the airport. To work oh at the airport? Yeah. I actually got a job at LAX just to see BTS. I know. Tragic. Damn. How did you guys feel about the Be Free commentary? Oh. Um. You guys could have taken the road towards becoming rappers, but you couldn't beat that temptation. It is BTS music, hip hop. It is wearing makeup on stage like a girl, hip hop. Years ago. From, yeah. <coughs> he calls them girls and yeah. tells them. That whole thing with the rap community. Mm -hmm. yeah. I mean, them? let's be honest, for the most part, even the Korean hip-hop community, or especially the idol Talk community, to me, Unk. Well, Talk to me, Unk. Creators you'll ever meet in the world. Oh, yeah, true. Let's, but, let's be honest. I, I, I mean, but at the same time, you have to understand, Beauty. Beauty. it's a country of, like, it's almost, it's a homogenous country. The question I asked, it was like, deflected. <laughs> so I was like, hmm, okay. Yeah, we don't have to keep this going a bit. <laughs> the cultural preparation so is one thing, but it's more so how like the rap community made them feel like other. That's why I'm yeah, kind of like they, about more. Because again, it, they're superficially just taking what they think hip hop is. I feel like when they first started out, there was just this like adamant, like I want to be this alpha male. I want to be yeah, this, no. like it wasn't, it's almost Authentic. like they had anger in him. You know, he, yeah. that was back when he had the perm, but yeah. we're not going to speak about that. <laughs> he, he doesn't want to speak about that, so let's just... <laughs> like, the glow up was just, it's just been immaculate with them. Yeah. So. Mm, mm, mm. She was so vocal in the, like, the first two rounds, but then in the third round, when we were getting really deep, she was crickets. I was like... I don't trust your words, Dala. I need Jose to speak. Jose, give me the word. Jose, give me the word. I'm with you, bro. A little bit too I much trust my guy, Jose. Many, like, official things, textbook kind of things. What is you yapping about, bro? You like official things, textbook kind of things. A whole bunch of nothing, bro. Hey, did Jose vote Trinity, bro? Get the fuck out of here, Trinity, bro. Yeah, they, we, we got it. We won. We won. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. Honestly, bro, my guy Unk over here, he's a fan, bro. My guy Jose is super fan. If he is not a fan, I, I don't know what to say, bro. I saw his goatee and the jean shorts, and I saw his name Jose. I already knew that's my guy. You feel what I'm saying? He is my trusted source. So I'm going to go whatever he says. You know what I'm saying? And hey, she seems like a fan. 
And she seems like a fan, bro. I think we got the mole out. My guy Jose. Yeah, I feel like they're good. I feel we're good. Yeah. Yeah. Because uh, I have one doubt. I have one doubt. Yeah. <laughs> it's like. One of you two well. has to decide if you guys have any doubt, we continue the game. Let's continue. Right. Okay. Let's okay. do it. I guess I started uh, realizing you could still be a K pop <laughs> fan, but not be a BTS fan. Mm. Okay. What's your doubt? My doubt was Nika. Yeah, my thought is you. Because you had no idea when I said Laji Molala. You gave this blank stare. I'm not gonna lie, I feel like she could be like a multi that's not, that doesn't multi um, BTS, BTS at yeah. all. But I feel like, like you were saying a lot of textbook them. things. Textbook Especially things. when we started getting- Hey, Trinity did say that, but that's a whole bunch of nothing, bro. Thinking to uh, the Be Free thing, you immediately started about cultural appropriation. I'm like, okay, that's kind of not on topic because that's something that's, that's evident in all of K-pop. <laughs> like, that's another conversation. We could talk about that What's later. What's your favorite V-Live but... episode? <laughs> I'm trying to think back to when he did the album review. Crap. So okay, what's your stuff. favorite Run BTS episode? Run if you have, army bomb. If I have one. Army bomb. I'm not gonna lie, I don't think I've seen every Army Bomb, but my favorite Run BTS, probably when they were in the sauna, about what was that, five, six episodes ago? I don't remember that. A lot of our um, fandom knows and loves these videos. We talk about them all the time, and he was like, Oh, uh, I was like, oh, bro, okay, bro, let Unk, let, let Unk think, bro. Dollar, stop. Let There's Unk so think, many. bro. so many, just choose one. Like, one was I trust when they Unk, went to bro. Six Flags in Texas, and Hobie was on <laughs> one fucking roller coaster. I don't remember. The other one was when they got scared, and they were supposed to go to the zoo, but then they ended up getting scared by zombies. Yeah, hate to see it. She tragic, bro. She tragic, bro. I think Unk now is a fan though. Confident? This game is so hard, you don't know who the mole is. It could be anyone. And the only person you could be 100% sure of is yourself. Whether you. I know who the mole is, you know what I'm saying? Because Jose knew who the mole is. <laughs> and that's gotta be uh, Trinity, bro. I don't, I don't. I hate that guy, bro. No cap. Bro is just yeah, yapping, bro. First impression, oh yeah, yeah. He's a mole. Fuck up, bro. Party. That's all you can be. It's if Trinity, bro. It's Trinity. My Lord like Jimin. You turn green, you have to successfully go to the mall out, and you win tonight. My Lord Jimin. My guy, Jose. Yes. I know you got me, man. Oh, yes. That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying, bro. That's my guy, Detective Jose. I'm happy that we won. That's I'm money so right there, bro. Happy. Money. There's no other way. We know who's not army. Like we can sense it. We can feel it in our bones. If the mole wishes to reveal themselves, they can step into the square. Oh! Oh, no, now I feel super betrayed. She walked in Trinity. like oh, black army, That's what I'm... black Trinity man. Army girl. <laughs> I am not a BTS fan. I'm an EXO fan. The one thing that I the fuck is an EXO fan, bro. Wasn't surprised about was that she is an EXO fan. <laughs> Who's your group? EXO. I knew it was gonna be an EXO L. I knew it was gonna be an EXO L. <laughs> what the fuck what is an EXO L? <laughs> Why didn't she show that, bro? Actually, wait. To be fair, I mean, anyone can wear a BTS shirt and be like, oh, yeah, I am BTS fan. She should have at least showed it, though. At least, bro. Yeah, the K-pop fandom is definitely pretty vicious towards each other, and I think especially after today, I think it's just silly. Everyone was super nice. Really, we're no different. We just like different groups, and it's dumb to fight over something as trivial as that. Right, BTS right. fans come in all different shapes and sizes and ages and genders and races. It's just a beautiful fandom. But you were hating on my guy, Unk. You were hating on my guy, Unk, because he was Unk, because he was 50. Come on, dog. Trinity, I got your back, girl. Um, if anyone wants to fight, they gotta talk to me first, mm. okay? <laughs> hey, I don't wanna mess with you, man. Let's just keep supporting the boys. I believe their message is worth getting out to the world. One day, if everyone could be army, it'd be a better world. Sarangay. First oh, time this kid in brought men out history. They did it. To catch you them did all. it, BTS army. Do not hate on the mole, try not to. Don't hate. I, I, my fault, bro. My, my hating days for BTS are over. You know what I'm saying? 
The only time you'll see me hate if that shit is ass. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? For entertainment purposes only, you know what I'm saying? Meditate. Oh, yeah. That's a Get the fuck off my screen, bro. Don't say that shit ever again. That was over a great video, man. Tay literally, literally said Leji more like that. Why did they kick him out? That's what I'm saying, bro. That's what I'm saying. And he said, uh, what the fuck that, what the fuck, Tony Montana, what the, what the fuck does that mean? All right, inside joke for BTS, I don't know. They still kicked out my guy, Unk. That's crazy, bro. That's crazy. At least my guy, Jose, Detective Jose got his money. He made money that day. You know what I'm saying? I'm happy for him, bro. Um, he done his job. He's a real BTS fan. I think there's more, like, K-pop type of Jubilee videos. I'll definitely be doing more. And, uh, yeah. Look, more BTS reactions soon, you know what I'm saying? I'll see you guys in the next one, man. Have a good one, guys. Good humans.